Hello SEO lovers, SEO beginners, hope you are all well. It's me Masud Bishel from Bangladesh. Thanks for coming to my YouTube channel. Today we will discuss with you about another important SEO tools that the, that's the name is Keyword Density Checker Tool. For the reason, at first we need to know what is Keyword Density. The expert SEO workers must know it. If you are new, you need to know that keyword density is a matter of keywords or keywords phrase numbers on a page or on a link compared to the total word numbers. By easy language, if I have any link or if I have any blog post and if I have 500 words uh, articles over there, then and if I use the uh, good keywords, high rank keywords or keyword phrase three times or four times or five times on there, then the keyword density checker, the keyword density ratio will be like 1.3%, uh, 2% these steps because I did use the keyword one times each on every 150 words. The good get density, the good keyword density ratio is 1 to 2%. That means one or two target keywords within every hundred words. Several words makes a sentence. If I make any sentence within 150 words, then the keyword or good number of keyword or good rank keyword I will be used only once on only once. By my suggestion, the good keyword density ratio is one compared to every 150 words. In this way, the keyword based sentence or keyword based uh, paragraph will show to the search engines several times, but several times, several search engines. And if you do keyword stuffing, then you have no, you have no possibility to come to search engine rank or to come to the search engine result pages. Now the question is, how much time I will use one keyword within a paragraph or within a article or within a page if you check the keyword density ratio is 1.5 percent for you then you have to check you have to use one keyword within every 150 words then if your article is 500 words then you can use your target keywords only three times after every 150 words and the, one of the beautiful method is if you make the hyperlink do follow hyperlink with the keywords then you will get much, much more good results why keyword density is important because of SEO because Google always show the results of several lists, several link lists to the search engine result pages about based on the query. So if there have some search phases on your link or on your article, then there have possibility to show your results to the search engine result pages. We will see the details within the screen recording system. There, I will use a keyword tool, keyword density checker tool. There, you will get the get the appropriate idea or exact idea. If you are new on my YouTube channel, please subscribe and press the bell icon so that you cannot miss any videos from my YouTube channel at the future time. And if you come to the middle, but uh, if you come to the middle, then I am requesting also to subscribe. And I'm also requesting not to skip the video uh, if you are SEO learner, SEO beginner, or if you are trying to become an SEO, become an SEO expert. Okay, we are already on the screen. By my suggestion, if you want to get rank on search engine result pages, then Google search engine, by the Google search engine topology, search engine always try to catch a sentence where 150 words are available and one important keyword is available. So in that case, if you follow keyword density 1.5%, 1.5% 1 uh, 1 means uh, one, per, uh, 1 on every 150 words, then that will give you go more good results. And if you make the important keyword do follow hyperlink with good rank website, then you will also get a good results. The previous session we have discussed about the keyword position uh, as a small density checker, you have to click on here and then you will find it and there you will get huge description down below they will get huge description down below about the keyword density you can read all of those and uh, for getting the good results for understanding keyword density as well i am discussing i am discussing it from my experience so uh, the website i will 
I will check that is one of my client website that is called directletic.com and that is a, this is a blog spot and for uh, on this blog spot I shall use one keyword one keyword density directletic and then we will get the key check density option check density then we will find the result and we will see the frequency that how much time the person used uh, the person used that the keyword directletic then that we will find a two words a, is the keywords he, he he have used on his blog like I'm going directletic option by two words we got it that is called directletic and the frequency is 0.71 percent 0.71 percent and by the good keyword density it should be one percent because uh, you have to use one keyword within every 150 words let's go to the website this is the website blog and there he made some beautiful articles every times and he's a good journalist and good article writer and there his ratio keyword density ratio is 0.71 percent and it should be one percent for getting more more and more good result because he have adsense beside it on their adsense and if the keyword density is or like one percent then uh, it will give him very much good results very much good good results before making the search you can include on here uh, like titles include titles and include alter text everybody know what is the alter text uh, to use important keywords uh, to use important keywords with on page SEO section like I am checking check density and in this way I will get some more good results there is a is available title description or h1 hypertext h1 check this is the more this is the means the keyword is two words so I have there I will find it and it's available on title and that should need to be used on the description section moreover you will get good and very, very much good ratio very much good statistics from here which will help you to analyze your SEO for or your for your clients SEO or for your another another SEO projects or for your personal SEO works so friends this was the tutorial about keyword density checker when you are a good expert, when you are a good practitioner about SEO or whitehead SEO, then you can easily gain it or you can easily estimate it. If you, are, if you want to sell any whitehead SEO on-page optimization or off-page optimization service to the world-based SEO marketplace, then you can see the SEO clerks marketplace related video tutorial playlist on my YouTube channel homepage. There you will get 8 tutorials and I will share the links at the top. And the last card and within the title within the descriptions also so you can see the tutorials and you can get some knowledge about to sell the whitehead SEO based services to the marketplace and you will get a good results hope you will stay fine on this pandemic situation stay safe stay healthy stay wealthy stay in care do not do not get mixture stay on social distance talk to your next video till then check here